At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It's Peterborough United facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? That's someone to play it to. It's a neat move. They could nudge in front. And the keeper has possession of it. City pushing forward with options available. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. And so they start at 11 for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne starts alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. De Bruyne. Well, Kevin De Bruyne, one of the complete midfield players in the modern game. Stuart, what do you expect we'll see from him this time around? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players, he can go past people with ease, and he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Sustained pressure, and now they have the ball. Promising sequence. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is really good. Low and hard beyond the goalkeeper. It's a lovely goal all around. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Well, they keep passing away. But then the one that fails to hit its target. De Bruyne Jesus Regain possession Clark Harris Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward while still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. And running through to the keeper. Now will the keeper have to pay the price for that mistake? Skipping away. And caught by the keeper. Well, there you can see City haven't been able to control possession, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. De Bruyne. He's lost it. Poor pass under no real pressure. And the ball with De Bruyne, and he's making progress. And it took a touch on the way through, so a corner here. He's protecting it well. That is that for the first half here. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences.
Nathan Thompson. Edwards. Grant. Taylor. George Grant. Johnson Clark Harris. Vital interception. The danger was very real. Joao Cancelo. Bernardo Silva. Foden. Gabriel Jesus. And he did well to cut it out. George Grant. It's with Taylor. Can they get in behind them? This could level it. Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Gabriel Jesus. 30 minutes to go then. Clark Harris. It's a perfect challenge. Rodri. It's with Laporte. Silva. And back with Bernardo Silva. De Bruyne. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. George Grant. It's with Edwards. Johnson Clark Harris. Spot on with that tackle. Joao Cancelo. De Bruyne. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. And Bernardo Silva has it. See your players waiting in the middle. It's wholehearted defending and the concession of a corner here. Trying to deliver it accurately. It didn't happen for them. They would be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Taylor. Grant. Well, time is against them. They have work to do. This could square the game. Oh, that's a penalty, and at a crucial phase in the game. A change in the offing for City. Chance to equalise here. The keeper going in the right direction and saving it. A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. And he clears the danger. Grant. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Big chance to get them on terms. Great defending. Oh, I can't believe it! Twists and turns in the closing stages. And it's anyone's guess who's going to lift the trophy. Incredible. Well, here we can see it again. And no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here. Deal with the danger. Otherwise, that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Can they nudge in front late on here? We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. Fuchs. Going well. Johnson Clark Harris. Well, that's it for the 90.
are back underway here, and it's quite simple. Both teams must steal themselves for 30 extra minutes. Silva. Riyad Mahrez. Given away by City. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Clark Harris. Fuchs. Johnson Clark Harris. A very effective challenge put in. Foden. Now with Silva. Mares. Walker. Now there to intercept. Fuchs. George Grant. Great challenge. He got nothing but ball. Gundogan. Can they take the lead? And there is the goal! He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, here it is again. And the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger, and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? That's it, half time in extra time. The second period still. And so 15 more minutes. We're into the second period of extra time here. Fuchs. It's with Edwards. Frankie Kent. Taylor. Burrows. Well read to put an end to that attack. Foden. City move it forward with purpose. This could finish it. Bernardo Silva. A goal! And that is going to be that. Name on the trophy for certain. Well, here it is again. And it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. Well, the action continues. And no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Well, five minutes remaining in this the second period of extra time. Edwards. He's very adept at protecting the ball. A challenge from Gundogan. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled.